What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Tony D2Wild, checking in once again in the bins, sipping gin with a couple of bitches, sipping on penicillin, about to get it in with some twins, and then we gonna fucking split them and then get them and then quit them. You already know what the dealio is, man. Anyway, today, guys, we're going on another top 10 vid. I haven't did a top 10 in a minute. I did some top fives here and there, but a top 10 of my top 10 kicks under $100. So this is uh, something very good. Whether it was uh, retailing at 100 initially or I was able to cop it for under 100, these are my top 10 kicks in that category. So a lot of you guys, feel free to click down in the description and follow me over at Instagram and Twitter at TonyD2Wild. And also if I find any of these still linked, I will link them down below where you can cop them for under that number. So all these shoes should be down below if they're still available. Let you guys know that. So let's get into it. Let's go. Coming in at number 10 is the Nike Roshi LD 1000 Quick Strike. I was able to get this um, at Sneaker Politics for I think 60 to 50 bucks. Um, they probably are gone now. Initially retailing at $100, I was able to get it for half off basically over at Sneaker Politics. A very, very comfortable shoe, a more casual laid back shoe. Looks very good with like some sweatpants and some gray joggers or whatnot. Something good to you know walk around in. And that, that uh, blue and yellow hit is just, is just pussy popping straight up. You know, you got that Golden State Warriors, even though they took it on a blue a 3 1 lead, you know, it's still a good colorway to have in that collection, that Laney light colorway. Um, straight up uh, Penguin Puss, man. It's a really good shoe to have in the collection, and this is my number 10. Now, coming at number 9, this one might throw you off a little bit. I mean, it's a really good shoe, especially for the winter time that we wear, and it's retailing at only 60 bucks, and that is the Rothko Special Field Boot. Now, you know these things come into fashion now more so with the right type of jeans tucked in, whatever people were able to finesse it. I was able to finesse it a couple times and it is getting that time again to where I might have to pull these out every once in a while. Nike released a pair as well that I got, but these were at like a hundred and like six bucks. So barely almost making it. Uh, well, not making it, but these are going for 60 bucks. You can find them. I will make sure to link these down below because they're just they're always like around 60 to 70 bucks Roth, with Rothko and some people like these more than these but this colorway was dope got that like you know navy I mean I was saying navy that olive like colorway so it's a very dope you know thing and it's Nike at the end of the day so you're paying more for the brand right here you're paying for like a good quality so this is my number nine the Rothko 60 bucks camel's backbone with an ass astronaut fucking it from the back man straight up no number nine Coming in at number eight, this is the uh, Stan Smith Adidas in the all red, that drip drip, you know what I'm saying, that blood red, um, and all suede. I think these are retailing around 80 bucks initially. I got these from um, uh, from Champ Sports. This is like, this is this material is made out of 21 Savage's actual blood. Like they took it and dropped his blood, and then DNA copied it to get that specific color red. That that you know that black black, you know what I'm saying. Yeah, people are sleeping on these Stan Smiths, especially in this colorway. This is like a straight, this Apple's Pussy color. Straight up. Apple, big Apple Pussy on it. Stan Smith, 80 bucks. Can't go wrong with a Stan Smith. Never can go wrong with a Stan Smith. And uh, the price, you can't either. Quality, amazing. Just be, where, just be cautious where you wear this at, because you don't want to be in the wrong neighborhood at the wrong time with these. This is number eight. Coming in at number seven, I caught these a long time ago, guys. I think like for 60 bucks. This is the Reebok classic city pack and this is the philly colorway um i gotta clean these these are fucked so i haven't worn these in a good time i won't even lie uh it's like that rocco's modern life type of look that philly fresh prince of bel-air kind of all pattern going on but a really really classic shoe reeboks are just still sitting under the 100 mark and various different colorways you got like the kendricks the split decisions a lot of them shoes are just still sitting under that you know 80 mark 80 dollar mark so it's a very very dope shoe and yeah, this is like Rocco Mother's life fucking the cat, you know, or uh, it's Rocco's and Ren and Stimpy all fucking each other at the same damn time. I don't know, it's a really cr crazy colorway. Got that gray Philly. Where you at, man? Reebok Classic, and this is my number seven top shoe for under Honda. Coming in at number six, these initially re retailed for about like 110 or something, but I was able to get them for a hundred dollars thanks to my boy C Hackett. That is this, uh, the uh, Nike um, SB. 31st state, the California colorway. You can find these on eBay now for like 70 bucks. They're easy to get them now on eBay for like under retail. They're floating around. Find them, you know, dead stock might be a little bit harder, but you, you're able to get your thing popping on these, man. Straight, made out of straight uh, grizzly bear asshole right here. You got the grizzly bear's asshole mixed with some motherfucking sheepskin. 
leather all going around it. Thanks, D-Money, for fucking it up. But anyways, yeah, man, this is a very, very dope colorway. I had to represent for my state, 31st state, Cali. And um, you can get these for under retail for 100 Easily, easily, easily. And this is the Jordan. Uh, I just wanted to say Jordan. I just wanted to say it. I just wanted to keep saying Jordan for some reason. I probably said it. Not SB, third first state. Pussy. Coming in at number five, this one was tough because it could go, it, it could really be four, three, two, but I just had to put it at number five to be generous. And that is the Saucony Jazz 89, I believe it's 89. It's a combination of the Jazz original with the uh, Shadow 5000 on the bottom. Has this really dope, like, Kevlar type look going on, like that army type look. The colorway is, uh, is just perfect. The material of the Kevlar is just perfect. The suede, you know, hints on the back and on the toe box. And then the wax, like, yarn, like, laces just made it a classic to me and it's like people look at it and you got it has that collab like look like it could be like a special forces type of shoe or something i don't know but um it's just a regular Saucony and i think they're going for retail like 80 bucks still on the Saucony site so you can go check that out link it down below you know what i'm saying very very basic like shoe and it's just it's just straight pussy popping man pussy popping on the fucking handstand Saucony 89 80 bucks can't fuck with it love her hater blew her brains out unforgivable Number five. Coming in at number four, I got these from Jack Threads for 80 bucks. And that is the Red Toe Reebok Questions. Um, they should still be going on sites for like 80 bucks. One of the most classic shoes, maybe the, the best, like the best athlete priced shoe, like high athlete, Allen Iverson. It's not that many more that are priced at 80 bucks for like an actual dope basketball shoe. I don't I don't know. I had another Reebok question I got. I don't know if I maybe got these on sale, but I ended up paying, like I said, 80 bucks at Jack the Rest for this one. Um, I would check on the internet, on eBay. They should be some laying around for that $80 price mark. I just don't know. This is one of the most classic, you know, basketball sneakers. And for it being under 100 bucks is amazing because you can't find that nowadays. It's, it's crazy. But uh, Reebok question, the red toe. It's just, we're talking about practice at the end of the day. David, what are we talking about? Practice. We're just talking about practice. Not a game. Not a game. Not a game. Practice. This is number four. Now we're getting into that top three, guys. And it's getting a little tougher now. Tougher, tougher, tougher. So this one had to be there. A lot of people would probably sleep on this one. And this is the Nike Air Tech Challenge 3, I believe. The 3. I want to say the 3. I might be wrong. It might be, it might be the 2. Uh, this is in the Hot Lava colorway when these were initially dropped. They went crazy. Like people were going crazy over them initially dropping. I think retailing like at one something, one twenty or something. And then um, I waited a long time. I waited and waited and waited, and I was able to get them for like somebody copped them at a um, at a um, what was it called a uh, discount store, Nike store, whatever. Fucking what's it called? Not discount. I guess this. You know what I mean? Outlet. Yeah, outlet, outlet. Yeah, and they sold it to me for eighty bucks. And then they even dropped even lower on Foot Locker for like 50 or 60 for a long time. They still might be on there. I don't know. But they're going like for 50, 60 right now. And this shoe was going crazy when they initially retroed it. But uh, a very, very dope shoe. Andre Agassi, you know, the W, the, 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 the legend. You can't beat it for 50 bucks. And then what they were going for at the time, people were reselling them for like 200. You know, one. I think they retailed, like I said, 160 or 120. One of those two numbers. But... You can get them for 100 bucks now if you really look. So look for them. See them. Air Tech Challenge. Hot Lava. Number three. Coming in at number two. A lot of people ask me about this shoe. They want to buy these from me. But I'm like, nah, now I'm straight. That is the Vans Skate High reissue with the wax denim look on it. All red. Retailing at like 60 bucks. Um, a lot of people want to cop them. And I'll be like, nah, I'm straight. Just because I can't find them nowadays. They released them in different colors. Like some denim colorway. And all that but i kind of just kept kept it like i couldn't sell them you know what i'm saying 60 bucks is just not it's not enough um it's like a wax rhinoceros asshole so it has a really nice smooth feeling to it nut butter. nut butter sauce right here on the side you got a lot of nut butter on there and you got nut butter inside cream pop pie pussy all in there you know what i'm saying it smells good still anyway the skate high reissue return like at 60 bucks vans all go for under 100 like most of them so that's one of the most affordable kicks out there. Those and Converse's. I don't have any Converse's, so I'll take that L. But yeah, Vans, Skate High Reissue, number two. Last but not least, coming at number one, this is my like favorite bang for the buck. You get quality, you get a nice look, you get everything for the price of 100 bucks. Somebody just texted me. It's my cousin. 
But anyways, number one is the Saucony Jazz. Peanut butter pussy. He was waiting on that one. He right, walked out the right room. He was waiting on that one. He he walked out. He walked out the room. Is that good? Yeah. Peanut butter pussy sauce. You was waiting on that because you were just I looking just at it. it as soon as I grabbed it, he just was like, I'm finally my chance. Peanut butter pussy sauce. Saucony Jazz Premium. Retailing at $100 flat. It's still available in black and in this peanut butter sauce. Um, amazing co colorway. Just straight llama asshole. Camel's back. You got camel's forearm right here. Leather. White bottom. White bottom. You know what I'm saying? Gold tips. We in it like swimmer. You know, um, this is the number one kick, and this is the Saucony Jazz Premium in that tan colorway. Number one. Let's get it. All right, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to leave a like button, comment, and subscribe. Feel free to comment down below what your thoughts, opinions, what your top ten is. If you want to see more top five or top ten vids and have any ideas, Please link, uh, comment down below. Let me know what else I could do. What another top ten you would like to hear, or what else you would like to see? You know, video wise. Let me know. Hit the like button, comment, and subscribe. Go follow me over on Instagram at Tony D Two Wild and on Twitter at Tony D Two Wild. I love you guys. It's your boy Tony D Two Wild. Checking in, checking out. Peace. Forehead. Minutes. Minutes.